Oh, hi, I'm Kelsey. And in high school, I was voted most likely to get hit by a parked car. Now, although I never did get hit by a parked car, there was one thing that did take a major hit. That was my self-esteem. You, you see, you see, back then, I was living with undiagnosed ADHD. I was different. Well, now I'm here to show you that we are never done learning and growing despite our challenges and our differences. So what do you say? You want to come learn with me? Let's go! <sighs> oh, hey, Kelsey. Hi. What's up? Nothing. Oh. Something. Oh. I'm supposed to go to work. Uh -huh. And I go to my car. Uh -huh. And it looks different. Oh, like what? Like, like lopsided and oh. sad. Um, I think that sounds like you might have a flat tire. Oh, I knew it. Yeah. You know, the most cars have uh, everything you need to take care of that. Like, really? Like, uh, lift them up and take the tire off and put a new one on. Yeah. Hmm. You just, just go. Gotta just go do it. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll just just do it. Just do it. <laughs> yep. I... Pretty simple. Well, it is simple, but I think I still need to be taught. Oh, have you never been taught how to change a tire? No. Oh, wow. See, that's the sort of thing I think that a lot of people's dads teach them. Dads, dads can be a great teacher. Oh. Like, they can teach you how to make um, pancakes sometimes. Yeah. Or uh, how to change a tire, of course, yeah. They're good at dad jokes, too. They are good at dad jokes. You want to yeah. hear a dad joke? Yeah. What's brown and sticky? Um, st a stick. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyhow, uh, oh, boy. You should, uh, anyway, you should ask your dad if he can show you how to change a tire. You know, I'm a little embarrassed that I, I am this old and still don't know how. You, you know, everyone has to learn something sometime. Hmm. Sound advice, Pepper. Yes. I, I like the way you think. Thank you. I do too. Well, bonus, I actually, Ooh. I happen to live with my parents. What? Yeah. Well, that makes it pretty easy. And cool. You don't even have to phone him. You could just let yell like, hey, dad. Good idea. Yeah. Dad! Can I learn how to change a tire? Oh, I think he said yes. I think he did say yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited to learn. Yeah. Yeah, because I think it's really important to be self-sufficient. Well, yeah, and because next time it happens, you could be on the side of the road. Yeah. And your dad, you can't just yell at, t at your dad on the side of the road. Because no. maybe... Some other dad will hear you and he'll come and he'll be like, who are you? And you'll be like, I'm Kelsey. And he'll be like, I don't know any Kelsey. And he'll be like. I get it. Okay, thank you. Plus, dads have an expiry date too. Let's not talk about that. Okay, let's not talk about that. Yeah, that's pretty dark. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, well, uh, I again, once again, I'm late for work, yeah. so I better get that better tire get on fixed. It. Yeah, yeah. Get on it. Okay, okay. I'm gonna roll out of here. You how roll on out of here? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really late. Oh, ho, ho, <laughs> so many dad jokes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyway, I don't want to fall flat. <laughs> oh, 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 oh God, that's so, uh, oh, so uh, clever. I'm sorry if you're. Tired of these no! silly jokes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Bye, Thanks Kelsey. for the great advice, Pickles. All right, bye. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Oh man, life. It can be flat sometimes. What else can get flat? Your tires. My tire needs some changing. And what greater teacher is there than your own dad? My dad is the greatest teacher of all. Everyone should learn from my dad, or your dad, or your friend's dad. I don't, I don't know. But today we're gonna learn how to be self-sufficient and change a tire on our own. So let's get started. This is my dad, his name is Jeff. And today, 
he's going to show us the little secrets that come in the book that comes with our vehicle. I found this in my glove department. You don't know what that is? No, I don't. No. So this is all the secrets of your car. Oh, wow. Well, like a Bible. Not really. It's just some quick, quick tips. But what happens is there's a there's essential information. See right here? Yes. OK. And you, it says location of spare tire. So you want to read that and tell me where the spare tire is? If you get a flat tire while driving, do not apply the brake heavily. Instead, gradually decrease your speed. Hold the steering wheel firmly and slowly move to a safe place on the side of the road. Or if you're already parked at your house, then it's perfect. We'll just pretend that we're already parked at our house. So we're at our house. Okay, we'll get, get to the good part now. Where, okay, it you show It says on me. here where the spare tire is. So the temporary spare tire is designed for emergency use only and should be replaced as soon as possible. The jack and the tools are located under the carpeted floor panel in the rear cargo area. So the spare tire is underneath the car and the tools are in the back. Oh. So we got to go back here. Let's go for the walk for a walk to the back. La la la. And there's a dog there. Oh no. Wait, I don't remember seeing anything about a dog in the car, huh? Yeah, dog's got to go. Hello. Okay. It's nice seeing you, but you got to get out now. Come on. Outside. Come on. There, you made it on TV. Out. Jump. Good girl. Okay. Okay, now you got to go this way. <laughs> Good go. Go play. Okay. So under this mat is your stuff, your tool. So take the mat out and put it to the back because we're going to use that too. Put it right where you're going to lay? Probably, yeah. Okay. And so there's two compartments, but that one there has the jack in it. So we got to okay. open that up. Not this one, the other one. You have to push the latches and... Okay. And look at, look at what's in there. Oh, there's mystery letters. What does that say? It says tire changing instructions. Oh. So I'm going to read that. Oh, you read that while I'll get the jack out. Okay. Great. Tire changing instructions. It looks like this. There's pictures for people who don't want to use the words. Set parking brake before jacking. Parking brake is over here. All you have to do is push down. Okay, that's done. Place transmission in park. Well, it already is. I hope. Yep. Now it says block wheel diagonally. Okay, you don't have wheel blocks, but you could probably use a rock. Okay, put a rock if you don't have a block. Close the door. Tell your dog to get away. Warning, do not get under a vehicle while on jack. Really? Well, I thought you did. These, these are only for lifting the car for changing tires. If you're doing a work on a car, you need special jacks. Oh, a special, okay. A special jack. A bigger jack, probably. Bigger, bigger jacks, the more safe, sturdier. Okay. These are made to be small so they'll fit in your trunk in oh, your car. Oh, I see. So, okay. Okay, so it tells you where to place it. It does? It says there where to place it. it might be on the other oh. side. Park on a, oh, sorry, I'm not done yet. Park on a level surface. Activate hazard flashers. Oh, this is, these are rules for if you're on the highway. But we're pretending we're at home because we are at home. Okay, so remove lug wrench whatever that is, lug wrench, jack handle, ah, jack and spare tire. It's underneath. Underneath. Okay. Now, our job is to locate jacking points. Okay, so it says on the rear trailing arm on the lug. So the picture is it's under here. So you see the lug there? So you got to put it under there. Where that bump is there? That's, oh. That's the lug. So oh. place, place that under there. So this is going to go up into touch. This it. has to go underneath it? Yeah. Yeah, we'll, okay. We'll, we'll uh, lift it up a little bit to get it closer. Okay. <laughs> 
stupid thing. Stupidly handy when you need them. Yeah, it is. Okay. Want me to do it? Yeah, you do that. Get it. To, I gotta learn. Yeah, get it so it's how to touching, turn. so that there's a dimple on the face there, and just make sure it's all sort of centered there. Okay. Yeah, that's good. So this jack is only for changing tires. Only for changing tires, and okay. only for changing tires on this car, because every car is different. Oh, I was about to say, could this jack be used for another vehicle? It may be able to be used, but I would say use the jack that comes with the car. Okay. Okay. So now make sure it's nice and tight. Well, that's not. That's just. You have to still jack it up. It's still. Oh, I see. You're just positioning it. Okay. So what's what's handy to do is you undo the lug nuts before you raise it off the ground, or it's almost impossible to undo the lug nuts. Okay. So you use your lug wrench. Lug wrench. And on your lug nuts. Okay. Okay. So loosen. Just loosen them. You don't have to take them right off. So lefty loosey, righty tighty. R I know. Why is it so hard? So that's how cars are. All right. Life is hard. <laughs> Maybe if you lift up. So put it down one more and lift up. I see. Okay. So get on the. Yeah. Get on this side, maybe. Just, just loosen them. You don't have to take oh. them off. Just loosen them. One more, I think. What? I thought I did them all. Okay. No. Oh, which one? I don't know, the one back here, I think. This one? No, the other one. I did all these ones. Did you? I think okay. so. Where you're catching is, is normal father-daughter yeah, interaction. That's the, that's the one you missed. Oh, okay. I did. All right. So <laughs> now, time to jack it up. So okay. Get back underneath. Right. This hook goes under here. And this is what you turn. So you turn that. Much easier. Yeah. Until okay. the tire comes just off the ground. You don't have to go very high. Righty tighty. Well, that's. Or not. I well, don't know. You turn it right to make it go up. And if you see it move at all, if you see the vehicle move at all, stop and just get out of the way. Move oh. forward or backwards, just, you mean? Just get out of the way. If it decides to want it, it wants to roll or... Almost there. You don't have to lift it that much, hey? Well, the tire has to be off the ground enough that you can... Put your finger under it? Well, yeah. Get enough to get the tire off. So oh, you... not quite yet. Can you, can you see underneath the tire? You look at it? A little bit, yeah, I think it's ready. Okay, well. Okay. Then you could probably hand, hand spin the nuts off now that you've loosened them. Oh, right. Now, does it matter which order I take them off? No, not taking them off. Putting them back on, they have to go back in a star pattern. Oh, how come? Well, just to make it even, so, what it, so the wheel goes on straight. If it's crooked, it'll, it'll shake and they'll probably fall off on you while you're driving. Okay, not good. And that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. As Mr. Mackey would say, that's bad. And drugs are bad. Drugs are bad too. Okay, so roll that out of the way. We've got to take that to the tire shop to get it fixed. Okay. Take my money, tire shop. Okay, so now, now you got to get the spare tire down. Okay. Get your tools. Okay. Now, do all vehicles have their spare tire located here, or is it different? Sometimes they're in. Every vehicle's different, so that's why you need your little piece of paper your that book. tells you all this, tells the story. Your car bible. Okay. Yeah. So. So you you need the lug nut. Get that lug nut off the. Okay. Wait, I need that thing on? No. No. 
Oh wow, look at that, it fits. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you can probably undo it with by hand now. Okay. Take it right off. Would you say this is fun to do? Sure. I would say it, but it would be lying. We don't like liars. Okay. Okay. That's off. All right. Now here's here's Took that off. Well, here is the fun part. Oh. Okay. Get the, get your wrench. You put it in this thing here. What? Put it in there. It looks and like a belly button. Now turn it. Oh. Turn it. No other way. Turn it the other way. Other other way. <laughs> oh. Now look what's happening when you do that. What? The magic of Whoa! The tire's coming down. Yay! The future is now, man. Look at that! It's like an elevator for your tire. So I see it says temporary use only. How yeah. temporary is this use? Well, until you can get it. So from point get, A to point B? Yeah, get, get yourself home, get to town, get to whatever. Okay. Now, it's stuck. There's a wire attached to it. Yeah, well, you have to un unhook the hook and... Oh, I'm not done yet? Well, you, you lower it right down. Okay, keep going. You're, you're, that's the wrong thing. That's not the right thing. Sorry, okay, so it's not quite done yet. It has to go all the way to the ground. Oh, it gets fun once you know what you're doing. Yeah, so... Okay. Now that... There's the thing in the middle that has to come out, and that's the umbilical cord. Whatever that is, yeah. But okay. this, this have to fish it out up the middle. Oh, I see. Oh, how handy! And here's your nice, fresh, clean Ugh. spare tire. Oh, it's like an artifact. Yeah. Wow, is it ever dirty. Yeah, that's from never taking it off or never cleaning it. So, what do you do if your spare tire needs a spare tire? You call the tow truck. Okay, because that can happen. So always make sure that your spare tire is usable. And this is quite usable, just very dirty. Yep. Okay. All right, so. Put it back on now? Put the spare tire on? Yeah. Okay. I need guidance. Do you? Yeah. Well, you do exactly what you did, just taking it off, just the opposite. Okay, so we just you gotta, gotta put make the, sure. Put the holes in the right place and put the. Up. Yeah. Is there a certain way to do it? No. Okay, just. Okay, just, I'll just embarrass myself. Yeah, they're so light, because you said they were super light. <laughs> so, sometimes if you can't do it, if you sit on the ground. Yeah. And put your legs on either side okay. and use your legs to lift the tire up. Oh, that I can do. Right. But just for putting the tire on, you don't do that. Okay. Oh, that was so much easier. Yeah, and now you get out from underneath there so it doesn't squish you like a bug. Okay. And you put your yeah. lug nuts on. Okay, now you said there's a certain way to do it. Well, you that. just get them started to, for now. Okay, just put them on anyway. Well, the, the, the thready end goes on first. Okay. Yes. Now, do, your, do these ever fall off? Well, they do, and that's not good. So you have to make sure you put them on tight enough when they're... Okay. The tire shops have a torque wrench. Oh. It's a wrench that makes sure that they're properly tightened. But if you can't have got one of those, you just tighten it until you can't tighten it anymore. So uh, now I do it with my, my fingers still? Yeah, you can do it with your fingers. And it's okay. easier if you go opposite. So go okay. to the other side. So. Just, yeah, tighten that one. Just spin them all on by hand. It's like changing a radio station. Sure. Yeah. When do you change a radio station like that? You press a button to change a radio station on well, your car. Well, I'm like an old car. Oh. Pretty sure. Even I don't do that. 
Okay. Okay. So I don't. So they're know. all they're all kind of. Now the tire's off the ground, so you have to lower it down just so it's touching, so you can tighten them. Just lower it till they're touching, so you can you tighten them, or else they'll spin. So you went that way to go up, oh. you got to go the other way to go down. Okay, not the, not all the way, just that that's good right okay. there. Okay. Yeah. Now you tighten it in the star. Okay, with? So use your, with the wrench, the lug wrench. So you lefty loosey, righty tighty. So you went left to loosen it, so you're going to go right to tighten it. So you tighten. As tight as you can. Can you do it too tight? If you were really, really strong, you could, but if you're just normal strong, probably not. Okay, that's good. Okay. No, no, no not next to each uh -huh. other. They gotta be opposite. So yes. you go one, two, three, four, five. Sometimes you have to take the wrench off to move it around. Other way. It's hard work, isn't it? <laughs> Learning's fun, everybody. Everyone should learn. Oh, I can't get tired. Or stay in school. So, what would the alternative be if you go, I don't want to change a tire? How expensive would that problem be if you have to call a tow truck? A tow truck, probably a minimum of $100. Well, that's too much money for me. I don't know. I wouldn't know what they cost, but <laughs> depends because on where. Because you are self sufficient. Okay. Okay. Now this one? Yep. If you spin it on by fingers more, as far as it'll go and then... One more. That one? Yep. And then you would let the jack down and, and, then? and then you're done. You're ready to go to the service station to get your other tire fixed. Or go or, to the water slides because it's hot out. Well, no, you yeah. really should get this done as soon as possible. As soon as possible. And it says limit your speed to, what does it say, 80K? Now, what if you have a heavy load in your vehicle? Will that take that? It, it? It's supposed to, but I. You, you might Don't you might have to take the load out. Am I and that's going up, that's going down. Okay, you could probably turn it by hand now if you Wow, I'm strong. So strong. Sun's out, guns out. Guns out, guns out. There you have it. Changing tire. It's easy as one, two, three. Four, five. Four, five. Five nuts. Uh, yeah. yeah. Not glamorous, but people are very impressed when you, you tell you them. You got a little bit of dirt on your face right there. People are impressed when you tell them that you know how to change a tire. Trust me. It's a life skill that everyone should know, even if you don't even have a car. Because maybe the person that has a car has no arms. <sighs> Weak. Weak. <laughs> okay, we're done. Thank you so much. Thank you, Dad. You're welcome. Yeah. I love you. Love you. <sighs> oh. Ooh, hey, Kels, you look like you've worked up a sweat. Oh. It was a workout. Yeah, I out there changing the tire that. in the heat. Did you get it done? Oh, heck yeah, I got it done. Nice! Yeah. You're set now. If your tire ever explodes, you'll be able to fix it. 
Yeah. I, yeah. I, I mean, hope it doesn't explode. No, of course, of course. I don't have bombs for tires. Oh, are you sure? No. Yeah, so you should be careful. Anyway, I'm done now. Perfect. I, I have a whole day of just nothingness. Like, oh, but like, what? weren't you going somewhere? Isn't that why you had to change your tire? Oh. <gasps> my job. Oh, your job. Oh, my. Oh, wow. Uh oh. Oh, oh. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, that was, that, that was a while ago. Well, uh. Yeah. Um. Uh. I, I think, you know, it's been. I've, I'm so late. You could be early for tomorrow. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Might as well just hang out. Might as well. Okay. Okay. What do you want to do? Um, I don't know. I'm stressed out all of a sudden. We could watch a movie and relax. I think I have to go job hunting. This is our show. This is our show. The more you watch, the more you know. Caution! Eclectic!